welcome back to another episode of You and I Can Talk Shit. And if you got too quick from we're doing today. Uh, today we're gonna talk about Jeff Bezos and him thrusting into the atmosphere yeah. with his giant cylinder. <laughs> oh. oh it's gonna be so good. His giant oh. giant rocket. Fuck his yeah. His giant schlong. His giant dick shaped fucking. You mean uh, if, if this that thing? isn't him trying to fucking overcompensate, what the fuck? No, no, I don't think it's overcompensating. I think it's more like I'm gonna fuck well, the yeah. heavens. Uh, yeah, it's not really overcompensating because like, you know, not to point anything out, but it's not as big as Musk's. That's what it's going Musk has a go. This thing's going to be head on it. It's like this part is this big part of a thing with his big head. Yeah, he's got the Musk's has just got this girth. Here's the girth. Oh, Once he puts the two together, man, it's going to have that length like a mother. Oh, we still haven't even seen it before we were in trouble. No, no, we haven't. We've only seen it for half. Oh, 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 he's only got a chub. But this, yeah. I think this is full size though. So this is as big as it gets for bed night. <laughs> Who knows? He's got a shiny head like him. Maybe he's just trying to make it look like himself. Giant right. dick. dick. <laughs> so with that, on uh, I believe it's oh shit, 15 days after, which is the fifth. I think it's the 20th, 21st, something like that. Is it? I think he's heading off. It might be the 25th. I don't know. Around that time, 25th. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Next month. If you want to buy a ticket, it's only uh, it'll like be the first dick to go five space. million, isn't it? And the first dick in a dick. Yeah, yeah. Um, uh, yeah if you want to buy No, well, yeah, there's I'll one ticket. The ticket. Um, so there's one ticket left available. Like, he's already given us, like, decide who the other tickets go to. I think it's his brother as well. A, long trip a few other place. people. I don't know who the others are. Anyway, because um, it's six people, I think it fits. But anyway, that's why it's got such a big head. <laughs> um, <laughs> anyway, I was just saying, I fucking forgot that. Um, uh, one ticket, that's right. You yeah, can one. win them somehow. <laughs> no, buy them. Buy yeah, them. No, auction them. Auction them. Auction them. You can't win them, but you can buy one. If for you want to go 3.5 million. Yeah. Millennium Force well, Spin. You can auction your ticket. Millennium Force Spin. It's probably over 3.5. That did have a Force Spin. That was definitely cut. Oh, uh, sorry. You see, because you can see the like the, the the rim of the head. Yeah. yeah. But no, they only get like three minutes on that trip as well. Hey, that's a total. Three minutes. It doesn't it's matter. It's total like eleven minutes. It doesn't matter how three long it lasts. In space. <laughs> it it's all matter. about how how. What is it? <laughs> no, it, it, does. it, it doesn't. It doesn't last like very long. Yeah. Yeah. But, but let's be honest. What isn't as important as the size. I'm, it doesn't matter. I'm sure the passengers will say it was just fine, but. In reality, we're gonna know when they come back that you know they wish it had lasted yeah, longer. Yeah, when right. they come back, they never yeah, come you back. Know, you know that's exactly right. That's what gonna be the first thing when they get back. They're gonna say they're gonna be like, "How was it?" They're gonna be like, oh, "I wish it was longer." <laughs> <laughs> Whereas with Mars, yeah. you got six to twelve months, baby. <laughs> good. Uh, no, but it's all the to practice but, like, kills himself for that too. Three minutes, in my opinion, just isn't long enough. Like I've even heard of other people talking about. That's because you're greedy. No, but I've even heard that. Because again, it's not like it's costing energy once you're there. So all oh, you got to do is like not force them. Right, and that's what I mean. I've heard of people staying like half an hour to an hour and a half on other trips, and it's like, see, that's nice. It would be nice mm. to be able to spend an hour or like an hour. Oh, off the yeah. Of a movie, you floating around, fucking around, <laughs> doing backflips. <laughs> no, I'm just saying, about that length of time. No, yeah, no, even, on the again, even look at like other things like that, like um, for example, scuba diving and shit like that. You don't go down for three fucking minutes. How boring would three minutes be? Don't you get a minute and a half just from doing those fucking thingy drops? That's what I was thinking. You get several of those. <laughs> like, <laughs> why the fuck? I'm sure that costs less. Yeah, yeah. some of the probably doesn't. I don't know. Ugh, some of the plane 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 expensive. No, 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 it's still just a fucking plane. Yeah. Yeah. But it's still quite expensive because it's the fact that what you're, you're, you're still taking off and going down. And that's Do you reckon 3.5? I could buy one of those planes for that price. Uh, yeah, but again, this is a one ticket on the first flight. That's that's right. I could buy one of those planes and just go off so and whatever the fuck yeah. I want for that so kind of again, though, if, commercial. If, if, if this is what you're looking at for a, a, the first flight, though, this is the point. Like, imagine what prices are going to drop down to like as time goes on. Yeah. This means that average price is probably going to be the lower million dollars. It's like the first plane. And still, maybe. Yeah. There's a recent interview with Musk actually where he talks about that in the plane's early days and like exactly the fact that like, you know, uh, 50 years before the plane, uh, like 
50 years after the plane was invented, man like landed on the moon, or 60 years or whatever after the plane was invented, man, like, it was 1914 and 1969, so like, yeah, 50-something years, and then man landed on the moon. But if you asked anyone in like the 1900s, if, like in 1900, if they believed man would be on the moon, or told them man would be on the moon in that period of time, they wouldn't have believed you. They didn't yeah. even believe people were going to fly still in the 19, in 1900. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Like, people were still doubting flight in 1900. By 1914, we were flying. By 1969, we were on the moon. Like, it's just crazy. And that's the thing. Like, to try to predict what the humanity is going to do in the next 10, 20 years is just yeah. really, really hard to try and predict. Die off. <laughs> it's baby. <laughs> Can't argue that one. Oh, yeah, that's a talk on that note. Another day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. Another, yeah. A good yeah, day. So, on that note, uh, we're going to start off. Yeah, anything yeah. else, no? No. Other than Jeff Bezos' nice cock. Yeah, that's just. No, it's all good. <laughs> nice, yeah. <laughs> Making me feel a bit inadequate, but whatever, we can't. Should it be bigger? Uh, hey, then I feel really good. Anyway, but. first dick in a dick, go on space. Yep. Uh, next good month, luck. July 25th, I think. Good luck. Uh, yeah, yeah, hopefully it was success. Bring back photos. <laughs> <laughs> of your dick. In your dick. <laughs> In front of the planet. Oh man, that'd be good. That's probably what he's doing. I bet he's doing space dick pics. Do you reckon he's ever taken a triple dick shot? <laughs> like his dick within his dick in the background and the dick in the background? What? Just that's like, deception. That could be someone's name, actually. Anyway, peace out, everyone. Have like, subscribe, day. comment, have a wonderful weekend. See, See you next week. Yeah. Mm-hmm.